Flower shops, they've been working for weeks to get ready for Valentine's Day, packing up their trucks, knowing that they're going to deliver literally hundreds of bouquets and plants on Valentine's Day itself. And if you receive flowers, there's a big question. How do you get them home without damaging them in the cold? Because the cold can do a lot of damage. Nicole Ford is here with some tips from the experts. Hey, Nicole. Well, Heather, Rick, I know a lot of people today are going to be getting some roses. Many women, some men. But what's different about Valentine's Day this year? It actually falls on a Friday. So most people may decide to take their gift home with them for the weekend. Now, the cold temperatures, though, could impact their lifespan. So what should you do to protect them? We took that question to the experts. Patricia Fowler at Flower Rama tells you you have to protect the flowers from the cold or else when you walk back into warm temperatures, they'll turn black. She says it's like leaving your pet in the car in the cold. You shouldn't do it with flowers either. Her best advice is to keep the packaging it comes in and repurpose it when you head out the door. If you create a little bit of a cone and then you could just fold it over, move quickly, you should be fine. But 22 degree temperatures is going to be a challenge not only for people in their offices, but also for us in delivering. Now, if you're watching thinking I forgot to order my flowers this year, it's not too late. Most of the flower shops in our area order upwards of 40,000 roses, so they'll have plenty left for those last minute shoppers. I don't know if that's you, Rick or Heather. <laughs> 40,000 roses uh -huh. is the thing that catches my attention. Yeah. That's per shop. And so you start to think about the number of orders that they're creating, and they do it. That's not just something they started a couple of days ago. This is something they've planned for a long time. Are you avoiding Nicole's question? Did you order your flowers? I don't, I don't do flowers. Uh huh. I do plants. Oh. At least I'm going to this year. Okay.